at weddings. Will you fire a gun into the air as your cousin walks down the aisle? No, there won't be any gunfire at this one. I might steal the collection box if the move takes me, though. Oh, really? Yeah, I'll mug any nuns that are hanging around the church as well. You know, it's not that weird to think that there might be some shooting at this wedding. Not only do you seem to attract ultraviolence wherever you go, but this was the church where we had my brother's funeral. You remember how that turned out. Yeah. How are you about that? Do you miss him? I'm okay. He's still in my thoughts, you know. He brought it on himself and he wasn't a good person. When I think about him, I just wish that he'd been happy in his life. What would have made him happy? It's hard to say, but maybe the right person? Yeah? Do you think that that is the answer for everyone then? Maybe. The right person can make your life wonderful in the same way that the wrong one can ruin it. The problem is that it's difficult to tell which one the man you are with is. Huh. I've had some trouble telling right and wrong apart before. After the war, I was involved in a life I felt was not for me. Those decisions became very difficult. You're talking about your criminal exploits as if they're a thing of the past. Well, maybe they are. I don't want to be involved with the men I have been involved with. I want to surround myself with good people, not bad ones. Recently, I have tied up a lot of loose ends in this city. My past does not haunt me in the way that it used to. I've tried to separate myself from it. I'm ready to try to be good. Are you? Are you prepared to say goodbye to the fast cars, the drugs, the violence, the cheap women? Yes, I am. Do you think that the men you've been dealing with will let you walk off into the sunset? They will have to. I'm not a slave. It would be easier to be happy if I was with the right person, though. How do I know that you're right for me? How do I know that I won't get hurt? I'll look after you, Kate. 
I promise I'll protect you. There's nothing else I can say. You don't need to say anything else. Oh, time to preen like a peacock. Look at you in those fancy clothes, Nico. Trying to upstage the groom on his wedding day? <laughs> Let's get me married. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may <laughs> kiss the bride. Mwah. Uh, <laughs> well, <laughs> yes! <laughs> One oh, okay. oh, Yes, I did it! Go on, man. Go. go on, man. We have to leave, man. Just leave. Get out of here. Don't go. We take care of this, man. Okay, leave. okay. I was meant to protect her. <laughs> 